Hi, my name is Annika Zapeda and I'm a hairstylist and makeup artist. Today I'm going to be doing a style on my client Anna using Colourproof products. Hi, my name is Annika Zapeda, and I'm a hairstylist and makeup artist. Today, we're going to style Anna's hair using Colourproof products. I'm going to start by using the CC Primer Genius. The CC Primer Genius helps wick water away from the hair, creating a more humid, resistant foundation. Next, after I vigorously shake my Curly Lux Color Protect Curl Mousse, you, I'm going to apply it in my hand. You can also apply this at the root, but for this style, I prefer to use my hand. Along with my curly mousse, I've decided I'm going to cocktail in plush locks. As you can see, I'm not using a lot of any of these products because they're very highly concentrated. The best way to cocktail your products is to fold them into each other. And now I'm going to apply this throughout Anna's hair. All right, my next step, I'm gonna go through and blow dry her. I'm gonna start using my Colourproof brush at the roots to create volume and shine, and then I'm gonna blow dry through the mids and ends using a round brush, pulling it up to achieve volume. So, when I'm going through with my Colourproof Vent Brush, I'm grabbing at the root and lifting up and then hitting with my blow dryer to achieve more volume. My next step will be to go through with my medium-sized round brush and blow dryer. I'm going to be pulling Anna's hair up and keeping my brush moving to achieve lots of volume. Now that we've gotten Anna's hair completely dry, you can see that because I used curly locks and plush locks, it gave us nice bounce and awesome shine. My next step in Anna's style will be to use Colourproof's Iron Master. I'm choosing to use this because it will create awesome mold and nice shine. When I go through, I'm going to be spraying this per section as needed. I'm going to be grabbing a slightly smaller brush, I'd say it's still a round brush, and Basically, my technique is going to be to grab the hair, pull it up, and then twist and hit all that with my blow dryer.
So now I'm gonna lightly mist over Anna's hair because as always with colorproof products, you don't need very much. And as you can see, it's starting to create texture and waves. I'm gonna go through and do that to her whole head, misting each section with Iron Master and twisting my round brush through. <laughs> I would, but then I'm literally like giving it to you every single time. <laughs> Your hair grew pretty fast in the grand scheme of things. I think so too. I well, I started. I don't. I think I told you, but I don't think I completed what I said. But um, I started taking like biotin. Yes. Yeah. Normal biotin, and take one every day. And I had it logged in my phone that I started it like May. Mm -hmm. And so from like May to when. I Oh, I know, you have to be very... I have it right before supper. Right before supper is when I do it. So. I just need it consistently. And those chips and salsa are really good. <sighs> this is what my friend um, does on the weekend. Kick or something. Oh, but, yeah. but like I said, jeez, Josh, you have to get the whole new... Um, <laughs> A whole new plate of them. Right. And then he like takes a couple plates. For each section, I'm going through with my Iron Master, misting it root to end, getting my round brush in here and getting a nice grip, and then I'm going to start heating it up. And as I heat it up, I'm pulling it away, keeping my round brush moving. And as you can see, I'm twisting it so the hair curls around itself while heating the whole thing up to create a loose, tussled curl. Now that I've finished blow drying Anna's hair, I'm gonna go through and mist her with all around. I've chosen to use this product because it's nice and light and we'll be able to still run our fingers through her hair. I'm gonna shake this up really well and do a series of short blasts throughout her hair. Now that I've done that, I'm gonna take my hands and shake her style out. As you can see, we've achieved really loose, beachy waves. And to top it all off, I'm gonna go in with some texture charge, which I'm also gonna shake up really well. And I'm gonna apply this near the root area and work it out some with my hands. I'm gonna shake it and rake it out. One of my favorite things about this style is I feel that it's perfectly imperfect. I think it's fun and beachy, and it's definitely going for the hippie boho waves that are really in style right now. So, as you can see, through the back here, she's got some waves, some straighter pieces, and it's just very, very textured. That completes Anna's blow-dried beach waves using colorproof products. To recap Anna's style, I started by using Cleared Up Detox Shampoo, and then I went in with Super Plump Shampoo and also the Super Plump Condition. Once I brought her back to my chair and got her towel dried, I use the CC Prime Genius to primer style wick away water and help it last a little bit longer. I then took my Curly Locks mousse, sprayed it into my hand, and I added plush locks to that. I put it all together in my hand and I made a cocktail out of it.
Then I applied it to Anna's hair root to end. I then began blow drying. I used my color proof vent brush at the root to pull it away to create more volume. Once I was done doing that, I took my round brush and I round brushed through her hair, lifting up and away to create more volume. Once I got her hair dry, I went through with my Iron Master. I applied it lightly to each section and then went through with my round brush, pulling it away and twisting each section away from her face to create the loose tussled waves. Once I completed that, I went through with my all around hairspray. I chose this because it's nice and light. I shook it up and did short blasts throughout her whole entire head. Once I did that, I used my hands and I shook it, shook it out. After I did that, I topped it all off with texture charge. I applied this at the root to give her more texture and volume. Thank you for watching my video.